of my old man humor coming through. <laughs> Punctuation has never really meant much to me. All it does is signify when I'm supposed to breathe in a string of inept and insufficient words that indicate what I'm trying to situate between my consciousness and yours. See, it took me a long time to realize that I'm a conversationalist, not a conventionalist. So excuse me while I con the verse right out of this situation. Today you made a mad dash. The hyphen that you threw in the middle of our run-on sentence caught my tongue and my lungs off guard. You commit an apostrophe atrocity, removed all possession from our committed context. Suddenly I was a variety of nouns caught between the prefix and the suffix of words like unkindly, untimely, and unfair. And I was barely there as my arms flailed with a wild ferocity in the air, a typewriter trying to punch the last lines of this into your skin. And I guess, in my retaliation, I severed all variations of our status quotations. Only, when I stopped to breathe, that period that I pounded home felt more like an ellipsis, more like Morse code. And I was caught hanging in the balance between a good point and a hesitant pause. And what I needed next was rhetoric from your jaws instead of the exclamation that followed, your keys scraping off the counter, your foot pounding into the floor. I should have said, however, and then comma, 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 come on, let's try this again. But no, no semicolon, we can still be friends. No time to hit return, it's a clean page break. And I guess the three years of that looming fucking question mark always just looked like half a heart anyway. Bleeding out with every downstroke, just waiting for the full stop. So, instead of being the pincushion for your punk ass punctuation, I'll check my references and I'll bet they say, I don't need you at all.